Hi everybody, today we're sitting in this 2016 Ford Focus and we're going to show you how to install a Course Motorsports Direct Fit phone mount. Pretty simple install, but you do have to take uh, take apart a few interior pieces, um, but we'll uh, we'll take you through it step by step. So, first thing you're going to do is there's a uh, just a small panel right here that you need to remove. So just open up the glove box door and take a trim tool and slide it up underneath here. And just pop it out just like that next thing you want to do is remove this surround right here and once again just grab it and pop it off and just pull it back towards you and set that aside so now what you got to do is there's a small panel right here that says your airbag on it and you're going to need to remove that so stick a trim tool in right out and this one can be a little tricky um just get up underneath it and pop it like this right here and it's got a plug on the back of it so just go ahead and remove the plug and set that aside okay so your next step is to remove this uh the uh part of the console right here. And this is held in by three Torx T20s right here. So remove this guy. Let's throw that in the cup holder. One here. And one here. And then just grab a hold of this and just pop it out. Now, there's two more screws. One right here and right here. And that actually holds the radio down. So go ahead and remove. They're a little bit tough to see. One more on the other side. Okay, then you're just gonna take your radio and just simply pull it off like that right there. Now be careful because there's a there's a wire underneath here that plugs into your radio on the back side. So just make sure that doesn't get unplugged because if it does, you'll have to uh, plug it back in. All right, so now what you can see is your kit's gonna come with a, a bracket like this with a machine ball on it. And there's two slots in the dash right here. Those little hooks just go right into the holes on the dash. And then you just pry it up over the top of the dash pad just like that. And then it's got a um, it's got a protective pad on the back side, so it's not going to scratch your dash. And then you simply just put this whole thing back together. Just slide it back in. Just like that. And then you put the two screws back in the bottom. tough to see there's one and slide that over to the other side there's a second one Okay, now you gotta put the, uh, this part of the console back in and make sure you stick your wire up through like that. And then you put your screws back in this, one here. Number 
two. Okay, then the next you want to do is you want to put your little airbag light back on this trim piece. Plug it back in. Just like that. Put your surround back in and that just slides up forward like that. Open up your glove box again and put this piece back in here like that. Okay, so now your kit's going to come with a magnetic pad like this with a lock nut in the back. Just put the lock nut over the aluminum ball, tighten it up, and that'll allow you to pivot it so you can view your phone. And then your kit's also gonna come with some metal backer pads. Um, you just, it's an adhesive back. I've already got mine installed um, on this phone here. Well, then you're done.